I'm Mich- Michael Simonek. I'm from Czech Republic. My nickname is Flanker. And I don't know, I'm old man. <laughs> <laughs> I study uh, uh, Technical University in Brno. This is uh, the second biggest city in Czech Republic. Uh, but this is a very long story. <laughs> With overcooking, I started many years ago, uh, 2008, I think. Uh, before, computers uh, was not my hobby because uh, what I need uh, from computer was only gaming. Uh, but I was a uh, student, uh, not much money, so I had uh, old uh, PCs, not ideal for high-end gaming. And so uh, I start interesting uh, for my dream, new PC. So uh, I read articles at uh, websites about hardware, forums and uh, learn it uh, everything from beginning. My first extreme overclocking it was at nine, uh, 2010 and uh, with Phenom 2 CPU and later with Gulf Town. And after, I like it. I like all benchmarks, Cinebench, SuperPy, uh, Double V Prime, Prime. This is the start of the history. Uh, my best moment uh, were uh, when I get Tuban, Tuban uh, CPU, so Phenom 2 x6 6 core and I got uh, 6.7 gigahertz or something and I was so happy it was uh, one of the best uh, results on the world and still I think uh, my super buy in with Phenom uh, 2 x6 is at the second place or something uh, at the beginning I must learned uh, many things and uh, I have now uh, more experience uh, but still uh, the biggest enemy is time because I'm working uh, normally, I have a girlfriend, I have sport activity and uh, not much time for uh, extreme overclocking so uh, maybe fifth, sixth in year I can uh, use liquid nitrogen and it's still a nice passion for me. Yeah, as I mentioned, I think the right way is focusing on gaming, gamers. Because gamers usually want the powerful PC overclocking, uh, but they don't know how overclock. It uh, software of motherboards can help uh, him, him, help them, sorry. <laughs> Uh, but if we want more uh, extreme overclockers, uh, maybe the good way is what Sergio show, showed me. Showed me. Uh, Sergio in Brazil has a YouTube channel and they testing for gamers uh, some games with air cooling or all in one water cooling against liquid nitrogen in games. And uh, people can see. Yes, uh, now there are example 60 frames and with liquid nitrogen the same card, the same uh, CPU but higher frequencies uh, 80 or 89 FPS. So you can summarize, you can say. Yeah. So, I, I, so, so, I think the, so future uh, is, the future of overclock is to bring games and... Yeah, to overclocking. So, so I think uh, bring uh, gamers to the overclocking because community of gamers is uh, very huge. My message, don't be afraid from overclocking and start it. Taiwan is a wonderful place because uh, I've never uh, been before in Asia. Asia. And uh, people there are so friendly. Uh, the streets are clear. Uh, never seen before something similar. Of course, I was only in few states in Europe, but 
uh, these people are so helpful. You are in the state, you are looking around, you don't know where, where uh, is example metro station or something and uh, someone coming to uh, you and really uh, ask you for help. And really it's great. Only taxi is a very big problem. If you have not uh, some business card or uh, card of the hotel, uh, they don't know uh, where must uh, drive you. <laughs> it's crazy English <laughs> from my side. But uh, what I say, what I want to say is, uh, taxi drivers uh, really can't speak nothing than Chinese or Taiwanese. Or...